عندي قيمة لولا هالخيدمة وانطاني رفعة حب ابو اليمة انا اختصر كل عمري باللاطنة ذخر قابري ذخر قابري ما عندي قيمة لولا هالخيدمة وانطاني رفعة حب ابو اليمة انا اختصر كل عمري باللاطنة دخر قابري دخر قابري Assalamu alaikum, peace and blessings of Allah be upon you all my dear viewers. Welcome to the Holy Land of Karbala. Uh, a new report uh, from the uh, areas neighboring the Holy Shrines of Imam Hussein and his brother Abu Fadl Abbas. Peace and blessings of Allah be upon them. Uh, right now we are reporting to you uh, a new story, uh, a joint task force of Iraqis and uh, brothers uh, from the United Kingdom and uh, America and Canada. Uh, working all together in order to serve the pilgrims of Imam Hussein, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him. The thing that uh, emphasizes uh, the, uh, the, the well-known phrase, which is that Imam Hussein uh, unites us. Uh, of course, Imam Hussein have united the pilgrims all together in order to be, uh, uh, you know, uh, coexistent uh, peacefully among each other. And now we can see it uh, in terms of uh, serving. Uh, the pilgrims of Imam Hussein, my dear viewers, uh, stay tuned in order to get to know more information about this uh, service unit and uh, of course how uh, this uh, service is established and how uh, these people could get to meet each other and could get to work with each other. Stay tuned my brothers and sisters. <laughs> بهمومي وحنيني وبقايا عمري مثل فطر سنتا تشافي لكسري يا ابو اليمه بيدك صبح والله امري ازورك بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم My name is uh, Hamza Hussein Ali Daud and uh, I'm from United Kingdom uh, Britannia the way you say in, in Arabic, you say Britannia. Alhamdulillah, this is my second year. I'm coming for Arba'in. MashaAllah, we have a very cooperation with the brothers here in Iraq to serve the Zawar of Ahl al-Bayt, Zawar of Imam Hussein, alayhi salam. Now. Uh, now tell me, how do you feel about providing the services for the building of Wallahi, I cannot explain. It's very hard to explain the feelings which I have to provide Zawar of Imam Hussein. MashaAllah, MashaAllah. Uh, how did you get to meet the brothers here and uh, how did you start your work with them? Well, I've been uh, approached by my brother Shabir Mirali of United Kingdom as well. He said, would you please come and join us and serve the war of Imam Hussein alayhi salam. And so you got to uh, work it all together by brother Shabir? Brother Shabir, yes. Alhamdulillah. Um, so I was starting uh, putting my money into a box every month to come and serve the war of Imam Hussein. Alaikum, my name is Murtaza. I'm coming from uh, London. Uh, Hero, and I'm here for the Arbaeen, which is the it is a privilege for me. I've been invited by my Mu'la, Abu Fadl Abdullah, and and for me to come here to serve the Zawar of Abu Abu Abdullah, it is something I honor that, and we are with some lot of people, and they help us out, and wallahi there is nothing in this world that I make sure that I come here. Uh, yes. And it is something which I don't think in this, in the whole of this world, I don't think you will see these kind of things. You know? So, every culture, every people, Shias, everything. And, wallahi, it's something else. I can't, I can't, I can't even say it. Allah. وانطاني رفعة حب ابو اليمة انا اختصر كل عمري باللاطنة 
دخور قابلي دخور قابلي ما عندي قيمة لولا هالخدمة وطاني رفعة حبة فليمة عن اختصر كل عمري في الناطمة دخور قابلي My name is Taki Mosan Ali Haydari I'm from the UK uh, I've been coming here, mashallah, alhamdulillah, for the last three years. It's my third year. Alhamdulillah, it is an amazing feeling that uh, one gets when one's here, looks serving the people, the Zawar of Imam Hussein and Abu Fazl Abbas. It's just an amazing feeling, it's beyond words. We started with Brother Shabir, which you have, who you have met. Uh, it started all three years ago, mashallah, he's been coming for seven years, I think, now. So we, I tried it for the first time three years ago, and uh, Alhamdulillah, you know, it's it's like a bug, you get addicted to it, just come and serve. I would like to say that you have to come and do it yourself and get that feeling of satisfaction and see how the people, Alhamdulillah, people on wheelchairs, kids, you have to come and serve to, to know what serving is. Alhamdulillah. <laughs> جفني بدموعك لا تظن ينشف اتنفس انا وبس هواي يطفي والله it is a, an experience which you know I wish every every Shia or every person can experience the atmosphere which is here and it's something like until you're here you can't I can't describe it until you're here we have been coming here for the last seven years and alhamdulillah we look forward to the whole year we plan ourselves and we look forward to coming here for ten days to serve the others. We provide a full uh, meal service here. We start with breakfast in the morning and then uh, we have uh, different runs like we start with cheese and uh, uh, tea with milk and then in the afternoon uh, like in the middle of the morning we will have uh, falafel and chips and salad and all that. Uh, around lunchtime just before Zohar and I mean just after Zohar we, uh, we have a shawarma service, so we'll have chicken shawarma with salad and uh, na, the bread. And uh, after that we do fruits, uh, today we had bananas. After that we do cakes and uh, orange juice. And we have got a 24 hour, I mean not 24 hours, but continuous service for water, which is going on on that side. And behind me you will see that there is a whole, uh, the bread and everything is made here. At night you must have uh, seen what we do, we do the kebab service, which is still going on until we finish everything. And uh, the maukib is running open till about 2 o'clock, we prepare for the next day. I've got the brothers here who, have, who are all from uh, different corners in Iraq. Wallah, we never met them before, we met them last year. And we, we have, I mean, when I saw them again in Ashura, it was like we, we just met yesterday. So. Arbaeen coming to Karbala, Ashura, Arbaeen, this is something which binds us together from different walks of life and it is very important. We are from a community called the Khoja community. We are about 120,000 in the world. So for us, this is a very different atmosphere. Alhamdulillah, a lot of people do the walk, a lot of people participate in uh, Maukibs. There are so many of our brothers who have different Maukibs on the road from Najaf to Karbala, Alhamdulillah. And uh, we are based in uh, in in Karbala this for the last two years. <laughs> Dear viewers, uh, as you have seen uh, and heard from uh, our brothers out here who spoke of the uh, services and how do they provide the service and what sort of feelings they have being here in Iraq, taking part in the pilgrimage of Arba'in and of course providing the, uh, the services for the pilgrims of Imam Hussein. See, on the path of Imam Hussein, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, it's all about sacrifices and these brothers out here have sacrificed everything in order to be here in the Holy Land of Karbala, take part in the pilgrimage of Arba'in and of course serve the pilgrims of Imam Hussein. Dear viewers, thank you for joining us uh, tonight. Stay tuned for more reports from the Holy Land of Karbala. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.